me see. There we go. And I hope, hold on. I don't think it's still working. Was it just me? I don't even think it's still working. Hold on. Does it still work? Okay, it's good. There we go. My bad. All right, there we go. Sorry about that. Technical difficulties always happens. All right, let's go ahead and continue on. Ugh. Man, I hate it when that happens. German suplex by Grant. And I'm like, yeah, I'm like, bro, I don't know what happens. Like, I be checking my internet and stuff like that before I even start. And it's like, I don't know why it does that. I think it's good now. I just had a little spike. Oh, oh he's going to the top rope. He hits him with a frog splash. One, two, and a kick out at two by Bruce Jackson. Grant is confused, confuzzled. He don't know what to do next. Oh, and Grant with a counter. I mean, Bruce Jackson with a counter. Oh my God. I'm not speaking white today. All right. Oh, he's got almost some combos. And then hits him with a diving knee drop. Oh, Bruce Jackson with a counter. Oh, ooh. Oh, can he get it? Can he get it? And he hits him with a baseball slide. One, two, three, and Bruce Jackson picks up the victory and he will get his opportunity against spirit in a rematch Congratulations to Bruce Jackson picking up a victory. That was a beautiful matchup. Even though it had technical difficulties, it was still a great match. We will move on to the next matchup, and it is a triple threat tornado tag team number one contenders match. It is the team on the left, Negro and Rojo, the Sinister Army, the team in the middle, Quentin and Josh of the Waffle Gang. And team on the right, we got the returning tag team themselves of Bane and Limitless Lotus. This match is going to be off the rails, and I am excited to see the pandemonium that we got set up.
Huh. All right, let's get this matchup started. This triple threat tornado tag team match is definitely going to be an exciting one and we are going to find out who will be the number one contenders here tonight. Like the steel tires, <laughs> these steel tires, <laughs> these steel tires for fun. Who does that? <laughs> Not these steel tires. You're, bro. You're dumb. That is funny. That is way too funny. <laughs> All right, now I'm going to have fun talking about this team, the Sinister Army. They consist of four members currently, Negro, Rojo, Viede, and Rosa. Both of these guys, Negro and Rojo, are both former tag team champions. The only two teams in this, the only two the only teams in this matchup to win tag team titles are both the Sinister Army and Bane and Lotus. Q and Josh has never had an opportunity to win the tag team gold. But with two former teams that have won title, that have won the tag team championships, and Oregon, what is the word? I hope you're having a great Monday, a great day to start off the week, right? <laughs> This team here, this was a team just mix matched. Like they weren't even supposed to be an original tag team, but somehow they've managed and they've gotten themselves more than what they bargained for. The ICW tag team gold. Will they be able to become number one contenders to regain that match? I mean, to regain the championships. There are a lot of questions that need to be answered here, but we'll find out here tonight who's going to walk out number one contender. Not the stealing tires for fun. You literally came at that part. <laughs> All right, let's see who gets it. And this match is already starting off with pandemonium as Q is fighting Rojo, Negro is fighting Lotus, and Bane is fighting Josh. That probably might be an advantage for the Sinister Army with Negro being the big man in this matchup. And Q being the athletic one in this match, showing off crazy flips and flying expertise. They do though, man. Shut up. They don't steal tires. That was us. I'm dead. Which one are you talking about? Oh. Ooh. Oh. D 
DDT. And Lotus ground and pound to Q. And Josh trying to go for a moonsault, but steps out the way. Arm drag. Oh. Pulling the arm out the socket. Ooh. Since the army definitely looks like they have the upper hand right now. Everybody getting put in body bags, right? Morgan, get the. <laughs> why? Why do you? Why do you have to come in here just sus, <laughs> bro? Oh my god, you're. Oh my god, you goofy. All right, ooh, ooh. Rojo with that drop kick. He's definitely running the fade. Now Q fighting back. And now with Bane out of the equation. Right, Morgan is wilding. <laughs> oh. Ooh. Yep, they're outside the ring swinging. Swinging for the fences. I don't want to see decapitation. Hey, yo. They don't kill each other. <laughs> Half the time. Ooh. You got it right, right. <laughs> they are throwing hands. Q trying to go for a misdirect kick. Ooh. Trying to go for a moonsault on Lotus and it missed. And, oh my god. Yeah, I know. I, I I know what you're talking about. Ooh, ooh. Oh, oh. Logan, no, no. Lotus, Lotus has it locked in the guillotine, but it was broken up. Bring out a. <laughs> You wildin' yo. I'm dead. Ooh. And wait a minute. That boy Bane just hit. He was on that man's knee and just hit a kick on his face. That's tough. Oh, looks like Robo came and saved his partner. My God. And Lotus looks like he broke up the pin, saving his partner. DDT. Oh, thrown to the outside. I'm sure, like, if you want a custom made character, I'm I'm down to make you one after the show. <laughs> oh. Oh my God! Did Q get it? Q get him? One, two, oh, and it was broken up. This man just stay hitting flips. Jumping this man. You can't stab people. Oh my god. You know what? Do whatever. <laughs> I'm dead. Oh. Ooh. And now Lotus just got up super quick. He hit him with a Hurricane Rana. 
Oh, Josh got Rojo. He's got him set up. What does he have in mind? The Jackknife Powerbomb. Oh, he was so close to getting the victory. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my God, Morgan. <laughs> I can't with you. Oh. Just close my eyes and slash. I see why you miss half the time in Among Us. <laughs> This match is still going strong. This is a triple threat tornado tag team match to figure out who will be the number one contenders for the ICW tag team titles. Yeah, Morgan, that's what they all say. One, two, oh, and a kick out, so close. Yo, Morgan, thank you for the follow, I appreciate it. Welcome to the summer game. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Not cap. See, thank you, Jalen. Thank you, Jalen. Someone who gets it, they get it because they know Morgan is not a killer. <laughs> she is not a killer. <laughs> Terrible killer. Terrible. I say. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah, I have fun. I'm getting a booty call. All right. Thank you for stopping by, Morgan. Always, I appreciate it. Thank you for following too. Welcome to the summer game. You already know that you family here always. Morgan ain't in the streets, you feel me? I'm dead. <laughs> Shut up. Oh. Oh. Jackhammer. Josh kicked out. Lotus breaks up the fan. Okay, we'll see about it. Ooh, okay. Not giggity. Shut up. <laughs> All right, Morgan. I can't believe this match is still going strong, bro. Like, come on. Ooh, that elbow drop. That looks sinister. Ooh. This match has been going on for a hot minute. Yeah. Alright, 
one has to be declared the winner sooner or later. Ooh. Does Q have it? Ooh! Does Q have it? Two! Oh, it was close! Why is there so many close calls? I cannot do this. Oh, and he did the knees on him again. We got a pinfall. One, two, three, and Bane and Lotus pick up the victory, and they earn themselves a tag team title match. We're going to go ahead and get this match up started yet again. Well, we're going to have another match. I'm sorry. up we have a rematch which is non-title right now but it will soon become a title match it is the former icw diva champion non sequitur i'm sorry <laughs> challenging icw diva champion was to a one-on-one -on -one bout i should probably be keeping these recorded i should i should probably do that And there she is, the wild swinger, card dealing, shotgun riding, <laughs> styling and profiling. Two time, oh, wait, is she two time? Let me think. No, she isn't. Former ICW Divas champion picked up the title after defeating rivals like Moon and Pirate and Bree Bree. She stepped into the limelight and is ready to face her toughest challengers, especially our newest ICW Divas Champion. Somebody gotta put this person out because she is on fire currently. Our newest ICW Divas Champion steps into territory that she rightfully belongs in. And from Las Vegas, Nevada, the Intercontinental.
International Wrestling Women's World Champion, The X Factor, Caitlin! A rematch that's not entitled right now, but will be a title match sooner or later. Oop, starting off with some swings. Was able to attack her opponent. Ooh, suplex. She hits her with a standing Shiranui. Ooh. And a, ooh, drop kick to the back. Oh, moonsault. Ooh. And now Love's going straight to the top rope. Ball drop. Ooh. 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 They're throwing swings back and forth. Overleaf submission. She got it. She has got it locked in the anchor. And this match ends due to submission. Can this be the sign that Nan is ready for her rematch and is going to reclaim her ICW Divas Championship? Yeah, that was a quick, that was a quick one. That was, a, that was that was quick but it was still overall a kind of a good match but we're gonna go ahead and get the match next match up started the ICW tag team champions Jester designs and the barbarian take on deadly Crocs 54 deadly and killer croc in a one I mean in an extreme rules tag team style match I knew I shouldn't have lost that remote. There it is. Let me see if I can get it real quick. Give me one second.
The following contest is a tag team extreme rules match. And at a combined weight of 615 pounds, the International Wrestling Tag Team Champions. Combined weight of 440 pounds. And the Extreme Rules Tornado Tag Team matchup will begin. The barbarian is going in on Arthur while Joel is having his time with Jester. And oh, ooh. I have an anime picture to edit real quick. Let me find one. I got you. Thank you. 
Not the, not the crowd chanting, we want tables. Somebody who got a baseball bat. God! He is slamming them with that baseball bat. Ooh, kick out at two by Jester. Sledgehammer coming in the play. side and oh Ooh. oh and he hits him with a baseball bat try to go for a move and it misses And he breaks out the pin. Oh, just able to counter. German suplex. And he's got him in the electric chair. Oof. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, is this 
it. Can he get him? He's got a rocket kick. The Royal Flush. The Royal Flush by Jester. Oh my goodness. And one, two, three. And Jester and Barbarian pick up a huge win. That was actually not a bad matchup, and it was going haywire all over the place. That was a beautiful Extreme Rules Tag Team match. Alright, next matchup we have the Breadman Ace ICW Champion taking on Phantom in a one-on-one -on -one bout here tonight. Let's go ahead and get this match up underway. Not only is Ace the champion, but he is the second Twitch champion. Having a lot to carry. Ace definitely one of the lively champions. All right, we have our ICW champion and Twitch champion, and then we have Brethren of the Sama Gang, and we'll see how this goes. Oh, he ducks out the way first, but Ace able to catch him midway in. Not looking good right now. Ace is definitely taking control of this matchup. And oh, Phantom able to throw him off the rope. Oh, he go here. And knee drop. 
Oof. And oh. Ooh. And ooh. No, well, it looks like he's gonna go for something. Ooh, diving knee drop. And another moonsault. The champ looks like he has Phantom under wraps right now, and he's gonna go for another high rope maneuver. Ooh, a frog splash! One, and a kick out at one. Oh. And hang on, reverses. Ooh. And he flips him inside out. Oh, he's able to counter it. And, ooh. Ooh. But wait, the cow pressure. Cow pressure was locked in and now it's rope break. And trying to go for a middle rope splash, but it did not work. Ooh, chops. Throwing a couple chops in the punch. Ooh, combo attack. Wombo combo. And oh. Ooh, split legged moonsault. Wait a minute. It seems like there's an interruption. Who is that? We don't even know who's going on here. There's supposed to be somebody appearing from the side. Wait a minute. It's Blue! It's Blue with a baseball bat! Blue has a baseball bat trying to attack Phantom with Phantom able to maneuver. They try to attack Blue with the baseball bat. Blue trying to get out of the ring. Oh my goodness, it looks like Blue was trying to start off this match, and now this causes disqualification. Phantom wins by disqualification. What a way to end that match, but that was weird. But now we are moving on to the next matchup, where Blue is supposed to take on Shadow. <laughs> I have no idea what's supposed to be going on here. This man literally tried to jump him behind his back. And now we're going to move on to the next matchup where Blue is now supposed to go one on the one with Shadow. And there he is. Mr. Bad Temper himself. And Shadow not gonna waste no time. We're gonna go ahead and get this match up started. And now it's Blue versus Shadow one on one. Blue trying to start off the attacks, but Shadow able to counter in. And oh! Blue trying to able to counter that, but Shadow able to find his way and maneuver. Oh, trying to punch him off. Oh, Blue able to counter it. And now he's talking that crap. Oh! And that, that lured him in. And oh, he tried to get him up with a DDT by Blue. 
Blue with that technical genius that was able to get him the million dollar championship. Former million dollar champion right here in the making. And oh my goodness. Oh, kick to the head. Oh, he ducks. And oh, ooh. Oh. Oh. Oh, he was able to block him. And oh, oh, whoa. Blue was able to counter it. And he punches Shadow in the face. Now he's gonna go to the middle rope. Ooh. He's gonna do it yet again. And he's now calling for his opponent to stand. Oh! Wait a minute. Well, that's Phantom. That's Phantom's music. But he's nowhere to be seen. I'm guessing trying to psych up Blue. But Blue realizing that his opponent was wide open. Super kick. That was a little payback from Phantom. He sets up his partner for the right timing. Oh, he's going up to the top rope. Can he get it? He tried to get him with the elbow drop, and it was countered. Oh, trying to hit him with a move, and he ducks out the way. And oh, like, looks like Shadow has something planned. Can he get it? He yells out Summer Gang as he hits him with honor roll. And all oh, eight defeat by Shadow. Is this it? One, two, and a kick out at two by Blue. Unbelievable way to start this off. Blue had the upper hand and was the strike. Impaling DDT by Blue, however. Two. And a kick out at two by Shadow. And oh. Ooh, counter. And oh. It looks like Shadow had him set up for the Doom Buster. And he has a second impending DDT. And Blue picks up the victory. Jamal was close, Shadow was close, but in the end, could not successfully get the job done. Here is your winner, Azrael, the prodigy, Trowel. That was a beautiful match. Definitely going to start up some drama. All right, we have made it to the main event. It is an extreme rules match. Number one contender will fight. Number one contender. What was I about to say? Fuck, I, I forgot dead ass what I was going to say. Okay, 
<clears throat> this match will go on to fight for the ICW championship. This is a number one contenders match. baby what's going on i hope you're having a lovely lovely monday night you know it's always got to be great after work my wife i strippers i'll be lucky thank even still thank you for lurking i appreciate it and i hope your wife i gets better We have made it to the main event of the night. Weighing in at 170 pounds, Demon Ray. This man has no words, only action, but he is known as the Demon. former ICW champion ICW tag team champion Time ICW Galaxy slash United States Champion. The Dementor of Darkness, the Emperor of the Abyss. 
Mr. Shade himself. Both men have held gold. Both men have fought in the main event spotlight on numerous occasions. But now this time, we find out which of these men will contend for the ICW Championship. Will it be the Demon Ray? Will it be the Emperor of the Abyss? Shade, Extreme Rules match, anything goes. No count out, no disqualification, weapons allowed. This will be a match of the making and a huge punch to Shade to start off the match. And oh, that knee to the face. And all, all, all. Shane with the tombstone power driver. A stomp to the face. Oh, he looks like he rolls out of the ring to find his first weapon of choice. And ooh. And oh, oh, hitting Shade with the bat. Shade ducks a bat swing, but is able to get the bat out of Ray's hands. Ray already bleeding at the head. Oh my goodness. Ooh. And oh, Ray has something set up. Is he gonna hit it? He tried to hit the coup de grace, but he wasn't able to get to Shade. Oh, and he tried to hit him with a double stomp. Oh, Shade able to counter him. Oh, splash! Oh, oof! That merciless act, and now Shade able to stand tall. But now is trying to find a second weapon of choice to put into this match. Ooh. Ooh, and a double stomp to the chest.
Basement drop kick to the face. Ooh. Baseball slide takes out the leg. And now he has the steel chair. And he has right with the steel chair. Ooh. Seven Cote The end is this over. One, two, and Shay kicks out at two. That was so, so, so close. I could just feel it at the fingertips. Oh, and a DDT. Ray might have something else planned. Does he have a second one at hand? No, it was a diving knee drop, but he still misses the landing. Now Shade looking for a third weapon of choice to get into this ring, and he has a kendo stick. Wait, no, it's a sledgehammer. Ray able to catch Shade, almost hitting him with the sledgehammer. Oh, a little bit of 1916. But now he has it set up. He's gonna hit it again this second. Could it grab? And Ray! Ray wins the matchup! And he earns himself the opportunity of a lifetime. He earns himself the second ICW championship match that he's been waiting on. It took two coup de grace to end it all. And this is definitely one of the greatest endings I've ever seen in ICW. Ladies and gentlemen, this has been an ecstatic, ecstatic night. I have been on my, I have been on the edge of my seat just watching this. It, it is amazing. Ladies and gentlemen, we'll definitely be back Wednesday night for some more ICW action. But you guys always know, until then, I will keep you guys updated. We're going to go ahead and end this off with a raid. I got to show some love to my peeps always. So this time, we're going to go raid. Let me see. Let me see. I'm going to raid somebody. I ain't raid in a minute. Or somebody new I raid. Hmm. 